Empify was never built to be dependent on me. You can't build a scalable business dependent on a human. And I think I've done a lot with Empify for us to get to this point with the help of the team. And now it's about becoming a better CEO and building a business that can thrive whether I'm here or I'm not here. And so my goal for this year was to go outside. And now it's like we invested $6.1 million and this, this, we're only going to get bigger as a unit. And it's like, how do we tell this to the world? And so I said, this year is not about Ashley. It's not about what Ashley's doing. It's about what, what, how does Empify become bigger than Ashley? So we, we went on Bloomberg, um, which was a phenomenal experience, considering the fact that I come from Wall Street and the office I used to work for was 10 blocks from where that interview took place. So we're excited, you know, it was, it was a blissful moment. The blissful moment was over. I'm getting all these emails. I have no energy. I, don't, I feel like I don't know how we're going to do this. I, people come and go and, and amplify. I don't know. So I'm stressed out, literally about to cry, walking through the airport. So I get this email. Oh my God, I'm about to get emotional saying this. Okay. So I get this. I think everybody, come on. I, I, we got to all come up here. Come on. Come on. And so I got an email and Empify was named one of the fastest growing companies in 2024 by Inc. 5000. But for me, this really, really means something because this wasn't an Ashley Fox. They had to look at our financials. They had, we had to answer a 95 question survey. It was Empify who won this, the opportunity. And so we will be featured in Inc. Magazine um, as one of the fastest growing companies in 2024.